Hi guys, it's Laura here and I should probably turn that dishwasher off. Hang on. So, hi guys, um, I'm just back from walking the dog. <coughs> Excuse me, I've got a bit of a cough. I am in the process of making a coffee as I came back. Little ones at school. Uh, yeah, so little one went back to school today. Um, then took the dog a walk and I'm just back making a coffee. Uh, to get me kind of going for the day because uh, I work late so getting up early is a bit of a struggle so that is my coffee in my Aladdin mug um, and I'm just about to make myself some toast and put it on my uh, Disney plate um, but the postman came and uh, for those that watch these videos, you'll know that um, I've started a little business of my own um, where I'm making bags and things. So normally the post does contain um, more like bag parcels um, with fabrics and things that I need. Um, so I'm normally used to hearing like the drop of parcels coming through the door. <clears throat> but literally a couple of minutes ago, postman knocked at my door and I'm like, oh, what is that? Um, no, you know what, I do have a parcel coming, thinking it would be like at the end of the week and it's only well, it's only Wednesday today. Um, so I was really confused as to what this was. Um, so it's got my details and stuff on the front and it's also got like, if, if not returned, please send to this and I just did not register at all. Um, <clears throat> so I'm like, what the heck is it? Because, you know, you can't hear anything. Um, but I did slice it open and then I saw the Disney paper and realised I know what this is. So I stopped myself as much as as much as it was hard to. I stopped and thought, think of your YouTube channel, Laura. Think of the YouTube channel. So I stopped myself, got my camera out, finished making my coffee and that's kind of where we're at now. Um, so yeah, I'm going to open this. With you guys now, this is gonna be a really short video for this week's countdown to Disney. It's five weeks, four weeks, five weeks, uh, five weeks. I hope it's five weeks. Yes, it's five weeks. Shame it's not four weeks, but it is five weeks. Countdown to Disney. Um, <clears throat> so I'm just gonna leave you there. I was gonna like set you up and sit down somewhere, but sod it. You're you're okay there. Um, so we'll, we'll just. We'll just do it here. I'll just make sure that my coffee doesn't get in the way and hopefully you can see everything because you are sitting in my kind of spice cupboard just now. Um, <clears throat> so let's have a look at this. Two years ago, I think, just before I went to Halloween at Disney, I think that's when I went on the waiting list. Um, <laughs> this thing that I was on a waiting list for was for custom made ears. Now you're probably thinking two years for custom made ears. Yes, but these are special. These are hand painted custom ears um, that are just amazing. Um, I saw loads of her like previous orders and I remember watching a live stream of when she was painting a set as well and I was just like, I have to have a pair. Um, so the, the the person I'm talking about is uh, Sophie. Um, some of you might know her and her husband. Uh, they are on YouTube. Um, and I think DeAndre does a lot of like Periscope and things like that as well. Um, so DeAndre's oh, this is where I'm gonna cock it up. Make wear play. Red. And Sophie's. Make wear play. I hope that's right. I'm so sorry if I got it wrong. Bad new Laura, bad new Laura. Um, but anyway, yeah, they are an awesome couple. And like, I've been watching like YouTube, like Disney YouTubers for years and years. Like before my little boy was born, so you know, like I'm talking like six, seven years. Like holy crap, that's quite a long time ago. Um, and I've never really kind of felt like I've managed to be part of like the. Disney community as such till kind of more recently um, maybe like a year well two years ago <clears throat> um, I actually 
went into a live stream with um, this couple and uh, DeAndre was eating <clears throat> a rather big ice cream out of like a Disney kitchen sink thing and they made me feel so welcome and you know anytime like <clears throat> I said hi again afterwards, they knew, you, they knew who I was, I kind of got the nickname New Laura. Don't really remember how that came about, but I'm New Laura to them. Um, so, it, no, they're a, a lovely couple and you know, one day I would really love to meet them. I actually, like, when I went that Halloween, um, I know, I must have ordered the ears afterwards, but that Halloween that I went, I remember like seeing a bunch of YouTubers, but I was just so afraid to go up and speak to them and I remember seeing DeAndre and Sophie um actually they were like behind me um waiting to meet Cheshire Cat and I was just too scared to say hi but honestly if I could go back in time I would have probably ran up and gave them a big hug um so yeah they're a lovely couple and hopefully I'll get a chance to meet you one day um but Sophie has kindly made these for me and she is just amazing, like the artwork's amazing. Um, she talks you through it, you know, make sure you've got as much input as possible. Um, so yeah, I've rambled on a bit without even looking and I'm itching to open this. So let's have a nosy. So she's kindly put it in this little Mickey Mouse paper. Oh, and it's even got like bubble wrap, so they're really well secure. So let's just pull that out. So. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna maybe like tear up. Okay, so this is, this is them. Luckily I've got a knife here. Oh, like she sent me pictures of them before she sent, but they look even better in person, like they look amazing in the picture. <sighs> but they look like amazing. Oh my goodness. Like it's amazing. Oh my goodness. Sorry guys, I'm just kinda having a moment before I show you. They are just amazing. Like it generally looks like, you know, like a proper image from Disney that's been just transferred on like they're um, so amazing and really well made oh. oh they're so cute I can't wait to wear these in Disney okay so I'll show you the back first or should I show you the front I'll probably show you the front that's probably more common sense thing to do so these are them. So I decided to go for the kind of four underestimated kind of girls. I know they're not all princesses, um, but I absolutely love Pocahontas and Esmeralda. They're like two of my favourite characters. Um, and I thought, oh, it would be really nice to have ears with them on. Then I thought, you know, I also like Meg and Mulan too. You know, I like Jane Porter as well. Um, but I thought, no, we'll go with these four and we'll have them on the front like so um, and decided to go for the purple and the pink bow and then the purple around the headband as well um, and then I decided on the back of the one that's got Esmeralda and Pocahontas I would want some that like, like represents the two of them um, put into it and then same with Meg and Mulan so the back's I love this one especially. Looks like this. So this is Esmeralda's scarf blowing in Pocahontas's kind of wind. And this is like a cherry blossom tree from Mulan. And it's got like the Hercules clouds. It just looks amazing. I am like speechless. Just look. I just... Oh, you're so talented, Sophie, if you're watching this. I am just in awe. So, I guess I should try them on. So, they're so comfy to wear. They don't feel too heavy either. They're, like, amazing. 
No, I thought, oh, maybe it's going to be like a bit top heavy, but no. And they're like, so sturdy. I can't believe like how amazing they are. And then, well, oh, obviously, that's what it looks like at the back for you guys. Hopefully you can see that. I can't see that, so I'm just going to turn it around just to have a look. I could have had two bows and, you know, wore them either way, but I thought <coughs> I'd be just so indecisive. So this is definitely like the back of my head, uh, back of the headband. Um, and this is the front. I just can't believe how amazing it is. So good. I just want to wear these all day. I could. They're so comfy and just like, it doesn't feel like there's anything on my head. can't wait to wear these it's five weeks till I can wear them so um what um I've decided to do as well is um try and arrange my outfits hopefully it's gonna work around these four characters we almost have an Esmeralda outfit sorted actually I, I'll quickly kind of show you that oh, me or you like Esmeralda or Hunter not back in Amsterdam very little merchandise, especially in the way of clothing. Um, I found that the website EMP is really good for Disney clothing, um, but they didn't have anything Hunchback Esmeralda. Um, so I went on to eBay and, oh my goodness, I w clicked on at the right time because there was a lady selling a slightly bigger um, vest top that has Esmeralda and Quasimodo on it. But I knew it was going to be still a bit too small for me. Um, and I thought, well, because it was like second hand and it, you know, it wasn't too expensive, I thought I could attempt to alter it into maybe like a little swing dress type thing. So that is what I am in the process of doing. So I need to take it in still because I kind of made it too big, so now I need to take it in. Um, but this, hopefully you can see, is going to be the start of my dress. So... Yeah. So how amazing is this going to look with my ears? Ooh. And then um, I have a dress that's going to be representing Mulan on its way. Fingers crossed it's like an okay size. Now I do have a Pocahontas top but I think I need to alter it. Um, just I don't like tops that are too kind of like short. So I need it to be a bit longer, so I'm going to maybe alter it or just see if I can find something different. Um, not Scooby what I'm going to do for Meg yet, because again, there is very little um, in the way of Hercules things. Um, so we'll just have to wait and see, because I've got four, five out, four, or f um, five outfits that I need to kind of decide. Um, so yeah. So that's kind of the next thing is sorting out my Disney clothing. So this is this week's video. Um, so five weeks ago. Um, I hope you all enjoyed it. Now, if you would like a pair of custom made ears, um, definitely give Sophie a message. She's on Instagram and uh, Instagram and Twitter. Um, if you just type in Make Wear Play she should come up <clears throat> I will attempt to put links in the comments but um, if you know me I am not very technical so that probably won't happen but I'll try um, but yeah give her a message and um, you could end up with something amazing just like these again thank you so much Sophie if you're watching um, and tell me what you think of these and who's your favourite out of the four right, bye guys